During the festive season, many people from different walks of life are expected to flock to the coastal towns of Swakopmund, Walfus Bay and Hentis Bay. The traffic law enforcement in Eronga region, together with the police, have already put measures in place to ensure that all the road users adhere to the traffic rules. Chief Traffic Officer at Valfus Bay, Eben Platt, emphasized on the message of the Minister of Works and Transport, Alpheus Ngarosep, during the holiday. As we all know, it's a festive season time. Uh, we have a lovely weather here at the coast, and it is the place to be. Yes, uh, we actually, uh, it's very good that the, the Minister issued the statement, uh, and that is for the heavy vehicles above 3,500 to make use of the road behind the dunes. Yes, it's very good for us because the B2, a very busy road, this time of the year, specifically, um, the road is very, very busy. And with the heavy vehicles on the B2, it is actually our request to the minister that we uh, request him to issue the press statement uh, that uh, we make use of the road behind the dunes. Regional coordinator of the Namibia Police Traffic Unit in Erongo has urged drivers to avoid reckless driving and appealed to the passengers in taxis or buses to report reckless driving. When something happens, things, they always ask, where is the traffic officers, where is the, uh, the law enforcement? But I think we must start asking, where is the adult in the vehicle? Because you as a driver, you have a driver's license, you must be an adult. You must be responsible for your own actions and start blaming other people and, and start looking at yourself first and, and, and ask where is the adult in that vehicle. Um, and then also, then will also that will have effect that it will start changing the attitude of the driver. The drivers of the trucks weighing above 5,000 kilograms and who do not comply with the instructions to make use of the road behind Dune 7 will be fined $750.